We talk so rare, I don't know why. Because I think maybe it's because I can't split for each of you. It's not really fair. You often talk with other monsters, but not with me. It can't go like this anymore. Well, okay. Would you like to tell me in our rare conversation? I got an Elisa video to show you. What? An Elisa cruel video. What are you talking about? You can't even imagine, girl. Talking Tom dies there. Are you gonna show me it? Sure. I want you to be scared. What should I do for that? I need you to tell us a real creepy story. Otherwise, well, you know what I mean. Okay, okay. Gosh, he has some secret video we have to watch. Super secret, illicit. It's kinda keying me up. He promised me that after my creepy story, he'll show me some illicit secret video with a dying Tom. I can't tell you I really want to see, but since monsters offer me such a bonus, I just can't say no. Ooh, I love that kind of stories. Do you know the name? Really creepy. Don't enter the dark room. So are you ready for listening? I am. I'm gonna read from my laptop, so listen carefully, guys. Do you hear me? Yes. Ginger. Yes, yes. Can you just start reading, please? Okay, okay, let's start. There was a girl. Her name was Anne. She was 10. She loved the dark and lived in a big house with 10 rooms. Rooms 9 and 10 were joined in one, but were separated by a small hall. These rooms were always dark, although Anne loved the darkness, but she tried to avoid rooms 9 and 10, especially in the evening. Once Anne was going to go to bed early, cause she was tired. She was already in bed and was falling asleep. She woke up about an hour later with the feeling that someone was looking at her, but there was no one. Anne came back to bed but couldn't sleep. Suddenly she heard sounds, they came from the 10th room. She left her bed and went to the 10th room. She came to this room and opened the door, but she saw no one. Then Anne came into the room and the door slammed shut. Anne got scared, started to panic and remembered about the ninth room. Anne went to the hall, she walked through it, she was absolutely terrified. When she reached the room 9, she hurried to the door, it was wide open, but unfortunately the door slammed shut before her eyes. The light of the moon pierced a little in these rooms, so she saw the shadow of a man in a raincoat and a big knife in his hand. This shadow was coming closer. It stabbed her in the throat. Anne died right there. The girl's parent didn't find her until the next morning. It turns out that another family lived there before Anne's family. They had a girl the same age. One day this girl with her friends decided to call the Queen of Spades. They performed the ritual and an hour later that girl and her friends were found dead. The girl's parents decided to sell this house where Anne's family moved in. That's our story. I've done everything. I told you a story. You look good. You're happy. You slept well. Will you show me that illicit video with Tom? Sure, I'll show you it. Would you like to know something else before watching it? Of course. Tom died because of me. What? Seriously? You'll see it in that video. Let's hide. So let's go. So sorry, so sorry. Do you feel sorry for Tom? I don't know guys, I don't think so. Ginger is flying away. As I understand, Tom is trying to save him. Yeah, exactly. A guy used his laser from his mouth and again and others did the same. Tom used a mirror and Ginger started to descend. Ben is shocked. Ginger is still flying. Three balloons left, two, one. Seems like Ben can catch him. No, no, Ginger's falling down. Someone catch him. No, no, Angela. Angela will lose her, Tom. No, no, no. People are watching. Why are you looking at this? Oh, well, seems like Tom is trying to save him. It's so sweet. Oh my god. No, no. Ginger is okay, but Tom. I hope he'll be okay. I love all my monsters. I can't. Angela, don't cry. He'll be okay. I promise you, my sweet girl. I promise you. I know it. So what we see here, Tom saved Ginger. 
Our silent boy Ginger. I talked to him least of all. But Tom, the most evil Tom, saved his friend. You see, monsters love each other. Monster is monster's friend, not enemy. I don't know what about us, people, but with each other, they are friends. Angel is suffering a little bit. We'll find the truth. So that was our video for today, guys. Hope you enjoyed it. Click like and subscribe my channel. Also check this video. It's really cool. Are you ready to sing your song for me? Of course I'm ready. So guys, are you ready to listen to it? I am. Let's start. Okay, let me start. Say one, two, my name is... I'm coming for you, don't stay alone. Say three, four, I am talking... Lock your door, leave the lights on. Say five, six, I'm under your bed. I'm not my prince, I'm coming with my blade. Say seven, eight, you'll meet my friends. Gonna stay up late, this night never ends. Say nine, ten, I'm here, say hi. Never sleep again this night, you'll die. I'm taking my words back. Singing song is not always funny. Everything is creepy with monsters. Not funny. Hope you've got only one song. No, no, no. I have many songs. Tens, even hundreds creepy songs. No, I don't want to listen to your songs anymore. I'm just curious about how many do you have. Oh, I'll sing all of them to you, be sure. Okay, I'm ready to say goodbye to you. All your videos are good. It feels bad. I always have this feeling after talking to you. You do awful things. Eat worms, this kind of stuff. By the way, is Angela okay? Angela is very good. But if you don't come back to me, I will change all your songs in your playlist to mine creepy songs. And I'll make you listen to them every day.